I'm Khushi Malhotra. I'm a writer and journalism student from Delhi University. And uh, the poem I wrote that I'm going to share with you today, I wrote this because uh, I'm a fragile little one uh, with, a, with too many emotions that are hard to fathom. And people around have a few pieces of advice and opinions for me. And uh, this often enrages me. And this piece came out of it. So uh, my poem has been titled, The War I Wage Against Free Advice. I'm a girl in my 20s, slowly stretching my skin into short hem skirts and lace panties. Don't get any wrong ideas. That's just who I am in secrecy. They told me as a woman, I was too wise for 18. But now at 21, I'm way too naive. You see, there's a dilemma that keeps me fixated in this in-between. It's that I have some dreams and aspirations that I haven't yet achieved. The truth is, I need someone to tell me who or where I should be. To figure out who or where I should be. But every time I take someone's advice, cortisol goes all Jack the Ripper on me, all my nerves and all the way down to my spleen. In fact, I'm waging war against this business, this charade of free advice that I so casually receive from the passerbys of my life, who pathetically attempt to understand why my emotions are so extreme. You see, all I ever wanted in life was to outlive mediocrity and to do so with decency and honesty. But my emotions always get in the way because they operate a little differently. Truthfully, all I ever needed was to feel comfortable at being me. Now here's the advice I was talking about. So when I expressed my pain, here my teacher said, I shouldn't let my personal get into my professional pants, even when I lay waste my days to do her tasks in the most passionate way. A selfish young lady has the opinion that I reveal too much from my face. My mama had warned me, that she and Didi were a lot like me, and the world doesn't get the likes of us three, who let out a cry even when we're angry. Inside this heart of mine, there are mazes of veins intertwined, so thought A gets lost and crashes into C. And overwhelmed, I get to thinking, oh, Khushi, don't cry, please. I'm trying to do so much through the hardwired insecurities, but I'm trying to do so kindly. I just want to say, I've toned it down to the extent that the tip of the iceberg is what you see of the chemical storm that goes on inside of me. And if that's too much for you, here's an advice I'm about to give to thee. Do away with the crime of free advice, for some people are too beautiful for you to understand their sensibilities. Don't mistake me for a carrier truck. I'm Optimus Prime, quietly looking at you from the windshield.